Hey Ontario, how's it going? It's not a very good day over here in Ontario today. I'm on State Street. There's something burning. I'm not exactly sure what building it is. Um, I try to work my way to the front just now, but this whole entire area is blocked off. As you can see, we are on State, just west of Campus Avenue. The whole entire perimeter is blocked off. There's multiple agencies here trying to contain this fire, but as you can see, it's very much out of control. Fire trucks are still approaching this scene. They are kind of surrounded by vehicles that are just blocking the intersection and they're trying to work their way through. I believe the news is here as well. There's a helicopter up there. Uh, in just a minute, I'm gonna try again to work my way to the front of the, uh, the building to see exactly what building it is that's burning. They need all the help they can possibly get because this fire has been going on for about an hour now. And it's just right now when I'm starting to see white smoke appear, which is a good sign but far from over. So this is pretty much on the corner of Caldwell and uh, State Street. Obviously it's some kind of industrial business burning. I, I, I don't think this is a building at this point that's burning. I think it's all of the content that's inside of the building and maybe it's stuff that was laying around the yard. Look at that smoke, that's very, very serious. You gotta, you gotta give props to each and every one of these firefighters who actually is throwing themselves into that fire to fight it. I think right now they're trying to burn off whatever it is that's burning. They're just kind of waiting out, trying to contain it, making sure the fire don't spread. So if you're gonna be in this area anytime soon, please avoid it because campus and state, this whole entire area actually is congested. There's a lot of people that's very frustrated because they are trying to get home or trying to come over here to see this fire. I actually had to park like two blocks down and walk over here. This fire could be seen from miles. I was in Bloomington a little while ago and I saw it from the 10 off of Cedar Avenue and I was tripping out. I'm like, is that coming from Ontario or Chino? Sure enough, they're in Ontario. Got Ontario PD assisting with this whole situation as well. Channel 7 News has arrived. Yeah, this is extremely bad. It looks like a war zone. This is a recycling center. I didn't know that until I walked over here just now. Just to give you an idea of what this area looks like, it's extremely busy. Avoid this area, like I said earlier, if you can. This is the whole entire street, so this whole entire street's closed. You can see they're in there trying to get everything out as quickly as possible to keep this fire from getting worse. Very unfortunate because these people here had to evacuate. I mean, right behind their house is the fire, so it's best for them to leave for safety. Very active scene still. I've been here for about 30 minutes and this fire is just getting worse. Do you know how this fire started by any chance? No. Alrighty everyone, that's gonna conclude this vlog. Be careful if you're around this area. The air quality is really, really bad. Traffic is really congested. So if you can, take an alternative route home or wherever you have to go. So thanks again for watching. Hopefully everyone in there is safe and sound.